what's your social media handle? Just sleeping is for suckers. Sleeping is for suckers. Yeah, on just Instagram? one word. Yeah. Okay. We're not very good at marketing or doing anything right. <laughs> we just do this for fun. It's a pet project. All right, great. Well, let's yeah. have fun then. Yeah. I'm looking forward to this. You heard that Steve Linsky wants cocaine. <laughs> I think the celery salt uh, is great. It's like, that's like the finisher for me. Like, yeah. If it doesn't have celery salt, it's not really Chicago dog. Honestly. It's gotta be a steamed roses poppy seed bun. Absolutely. Yeah, okay. Yeah. And then generally, I like everything soft, so I can just shove it in your mouth. And it's like, just, I could just eat half of it, yeah. Half of it with one bite. It's a different preparation. Ketchup on hot dog. She put ketchup on ketchup for your fries, sir. She's one of Chicago stars on her head. See, and, and there's, there it is. The See, there right it is, there. right there, yeah. Bob Schwartz. He's in the Hot Dog Hall of Fame, I think. Where's the Hot Dog Hall of Fame located? Um, I think it's in Vienna Beef's uh, employee commissary. <laughs> <laughs> like so, so on the wall there. It's, it's, a, it's the smallest museum on earth. All right, fellas, you're right. fucking elitist. Um, I, I'd like a dog with everything, please. Steamed or char See, I like that option. I'm gonna go steamed. Steamed dog. For I'll you, go, uh, I'm feeling a little spicy. I'll go chart. Enjoy your hot dog, brother. Thank no, you, I got sir. mine. I got mine chart. Oh, wow. He's a what, definitely handle. What are we doing with yours? Same, same, same treatment. Oh, it's so good. It really is. I mean, again, the celery salt to me is like everything. But the crisp vegetables are so good. So, did you grow up around Lake, around Lakeview here? I grew up in Minnesota. Really? I think I was from Chicago. Sort of. No. I just act like I don't it. know anything about you, Steve. We just met. All right, so I uh... <laughs> I used to go to your I went to your block party a couple of years back. Oh, the pig roast. Yeah. Yeah. That was a blast. That was yeah. such a fun. We did like four cappuccino boxes. Yeah. I, I might have stolen some garbage bags out of your garage. Okay. Yeah. All right. I just needed some. We're even now. They got me the hot dog. Yeah, it's yeah. all good. Yeah, they, they look pristine. Maybe it was someone else's garage. I don't know. I was pretty drunk. I'm such a horn user in the wow, city. Thank my, God you take the train. My kids are. <laughs> my kids are. I was like, or my wife is like, enough with the horn. Don't be so mean. You're from Minnesota, and I'm like, I like the horn. <laughs> that guy just freaked out. He's like, Steve Delinsky just fucking honked that dude. <laughs> He's an angry hound. <laughs> Anyway, this is classic Chicago. This is tavern style Finn at its best. I ate a lot of stuffed pizza growing up, and now I was, I was, I was, I believe that that was the epitome of Chicago pizza. It's so funny. I've been, you know, talking about pizza now for the last two years, and I take locals on these tours, and they're like, I didn't know my pie existed. I didn't know what oh, Pat's was. was. Yeah. I'm like, these are great pizza places, and people always say, oh, I love pizza. I know pizza. They really don't. They go to three places. They go to like their neighborhood joint, they go to Lou's, and maybe one other place. When do these pizza tours happen? I do pizza tours every weekend now. Um, every I do a bus tour every Saturday, about three and a half hours, and then we have docents that go on walking tours every Saturday and Sunday. Wow. And they're about two and a half to three hours. The, the goal with each tour is you see four styles of pizza in exactly three hours. We just want to get people out of this mindset that it's only deep dish. It's, right. it's, Chicago is so much more than deep dish. My contention is that pizza, Chicago style pizza is thin crust, is tavern style, square cut, thin and crispy. Uh, that's what we eat every day. Yeah. And this is a perfect tavern style place. This is very much Chicago. Can you guys pretend to order? You're fucking oh, yeah. Me. Okay. We're gonna Can pretend. You ask them what they want to order. We're gonna pretend order. Sorry, it's it's his bullshit. Stop mine. <laughs> Hello, how are you? Hi, this is Natural. We are ordering pizza from you. All right, sounds pretty good to me. All right, uh, well. We're gonna. I think we're gonna do a medium probably. We'll do a oh, half uh, half pepperoni, half sausage with Chardonnay. All right. This is our first time ordering today, right now. No, oh, welcome we have to the pizzeria. Before. Well, thank you. I can't wait to eat. All right, sounds You're pretty good. You happy, Matt? Is that good for you? Was that natural? <laughs> uh, oh my god, we just ordered that like five so seconds ago. So wow, what happened? All right, bon appetit. Wow. Sweet. 
Thank so you. when so when you see this pie, like what are your first thoughts? Like what do you what do you what do you look for? Well, first of all, this pie? is well, this is Chicago style, square okay. cut. It's thin and crispy. Look at that side. It's very crispy. Yeah. Um, I don't want you to wait too long. I want you to grab an edge sure. piece. That's the best stuff. Heard that. Um, I think I'm going to grab. I also like sausage and jardinier. I'm going to grab from your side. So I Good see call. immediately okay. that there's no. It, it, it holds its own. There's no yeah. like that. flopping it. Shape. Yeah. Look at that. Yeah. It's as thin as it's thinner than a saltine. Right? It's really thin. Oh my god, you're right. I do love this shit. It's crispy. Now, look at this. The dimpled pan. Why do you think it's a dimpled pan? So my there's skin. air. Air circulation. Because you can have this in 10 minutes and it'll still be crispy in the middle. Yeah. And most times That's it comes crucial. on the cardboard and it sits and it steams and it's crap. Hey, one second. Hi. Alright, very easy bread. Let's do a second. Man, look at him multitasking. That's how you. That's how you. Uh, that's, that's how, how you big do boys it. do it. Yeah. <laughs> big phone. I got no assistant. I got no intern. Come on, man. Sorry. You been on Food Network? Yes. Put that deal through. Yeah, you heard me. Okay, word. Oh wow! I lost my virginity at 21 because I thought I was gonna go to hell if I had sex <laughs> before marriage, you know. And I was just like, well. Why haven't I been doing this for years? I feel really stupid now that it happened. Right. Yeah, and I wasn't, you know, obviously. You're not good at it anyway that age. Yeah. No, I, I, I was like, where's your penis? <laughs> <laughs> explanation about how appropriate a white Russian can be sometimes. I'm like, dude, you, you can want a white Russian. You can have a white Russian. We only have whole milk. And whole it's milk. warm. All right. Is that okay? Slightly curdled would be better, yeah, actually. Yeah. It's called yogurt. Uh, what are we going to drink? Uh, what are you drinking? Normally? Yeah, normally. Yeah, normally. Yeah, normally. What are we going to drink? What do you drink normally? Never again. I am an old-fashioned guy. I like bourbon. Oh, okay. Yeah. I do, too. I like, my favorite is, um... This is the weirdest Tinder date ever, by the way. Did we just become best friends? <laughs> um, I'm an Eagle Rare fan. That's kind of oh, okay. Like my yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Eagle Rare is dope. Yeah. Uh, I like Buffalo Trace. Yeah, I love it. Multitasking, multitasking. Gotta keep busy. Multi -tasting. That's like me eating and I'm being on the phone. Yeah. It's like, yeah, I can take orders. Make and you move. Eating, like, eat, and Make he's like move. shaking and tasting. I love that. I can do this. <laughs> I usually. Uh, like shake something else and cry. That's multitasking. Right? <laughs> Every joke with Every, you. Is <laughs> Everything. Is I'm still a virgin. <laughs> he's never eaten at Popeyes. You've eaten at Popeyes, right? He's never been to Pat's Pizza. And he claims he's from Chicago. That's that's, I, that's the bigger crime, I think. You know where I'm going tomorrow for for lunch? I'm going to Popeyes. You I'm should. Some Popeyes I want your. Popeyes. I want. I want to hear your take on it. Right. You're gonna be obese because you're gonna be like, this is the best shit I've had in a while. They do uh, MSG. It's like Cajun MSG, oh. and, th and that's like what you put packets of it on. So your chicken. Are they originally from New Orleans? I don't think so. You know, I have. I, I try to go vegetarian for my gout. Uh, I just can't. I got gout too. Shut the fuck up. You do not too. have gout. Yeah, I got the king's disease. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Are you serious? Here's the gout, baby. What? All right. Don't ever cheers yeah, gout. Don't really ever cheers the gout. gout right now. No, you don't. Like Gout's the worst. I just. The soda's really good. The soda's really good. Okay, right. Non-alcoholic, yeah, for sure. Yeah. So this is gout friendly. Gout friendly. If there anybody, by the way, has any gout questions, um, besides the gout hotline, call one of us. We can yeah. probably help you with that too. Uh, we know all the triggering. All right, let's go back to uh, beer for a second, because um, they have a lot of beer here too. What are you? Are you guys have a brewery now that like Mars is doing, right? So what? Are you? Are you interviewing me on my own? No, I just want to look at what beer you drink. That was a nice segue. That was. That was. That was, that was perfect. What the man do? Yeah. All right. All right. All right. All right. It's, it's, it's in your nature. I get it. Um, Thanks again. Hey. Cheers. Good to see you. Good to yeah. see you. I'll be seeing well, you sure. soon. Yeah. Right? I'll see you on Monday. Okay. Taco Monday. Taco Monday. Taco Fun Day. Oh, it's still light out. Fuck! <laughs>